بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله رب اشرح لي صدري ويسر لي امري واحلل عقدة من لساني يفقه قولي uh, Hello brothers and sisters how are you in today's lesson I would like to show you how we can create these uh, water jet marble uh, texture in Revit uh, As you see here we have uh, for this room uh, and we can, we can make for any kind of for holes for uh, whatever we want we can make any kind of design we have uh, and uh, for here I want to show, show you how you can do it in Revit it's for in 3d max it's pretty pretty easy it's not it's not a complicated uh, thing uh, but in Revit it needs some some works so we will uh, make it together as you see here uh, we have this kind of of cool thing yeah so how, how we can we can do it um, uh, for this lesson I, uh, we, uh, I want to uh, use f uh, photo Photoshop with it also uh, but if the, 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 the texture is, is ready you, do, you do, uh, don't need Photoshop okay if the texture is ready you don't need uh, Photoshop anyhow I used uh, I prepared this texture you have to download it whatever you want there are many many types of uh, infinity designs exist on internet you can uh, download whatever you want okay and I put it after that in uh, in Revit in this uh, on uh, on this floor okay so as you see here we have some some parts uh, that's very cool thing uh, with that so let's uh, get started the first thing just like before we need uh, uh, we make a new uh, pro project after that uh, we set the unit uh, from this one go to meters maybe to decimal is okay for me and just click okay for this one what I want I want to use uh, floors okay I want to use floor okay after that for we so where we uh, where's floor from the architectural tab and go to floor and after that I want to make it like this I want to make a floor uh, a, a room uh, let's say five by four or maybe by six anyhow whatever you want what uh, dimension you want it doesn't need it, uh, it doesn't matter okay here I have this kind of uh, floor I will edit it no problem just click finish okay that's very good. After that, go to 3D view, change the uh, this one uh, the detail level to fine, and uh, this one to realistic. As you see now, I have one one layer. Uh, I want to add another layer, but uh, first of all, I want to go to thin layer, so I don't need a thin layer. Okay, thin lines. Sorry, I have this this one. So I will just select it, go to edit type, and go to. I can duplicate it. I can say uh, ground floor ground floor okay after that go to edit I have point uh, 15 this is the ground floor I want to insert another one uh, this one I want to uh, give it name of finish and uh, let's say point oh two we have two centimeters okay and after that I want to take this one to up so uh, it should be uh, uh, to be on the top of the floor okay let's click okay and now we get this one anyhow so how can, how can I do it now uh, as you see here we have this one after that uh, as you see we uh, I can select this one and I can uh, create parts okay so it should divide uh, the uh, low, lower part to the upper part that's a very good thing after that just select this part the upper part and go to uh, top view and say divide parts okay we want to divide it after that we want to sketch as you uh, see here in Photoshop I have I have this one this image okay and this image uh, it's kind of of a circle if I want to just take this this circle I don't want to uh, make this for example if you have uh, something like uh, this for example if you download uh, a picture like this you can do it no problem okay so what I want, I want to uh, go to uh, sketch and uh, from the middle. Or how can I do? I can 
just go to make a line here and escape make another line here so I get the center point there are many many uh, ways that I can do it uh, let's say I want to point 5 okay so for the divide uh, I want to point 5 so now I have point 5 by point, uh, the uh, radius is point 5 okay after that we can uh, we click uh, finish again uh, I can go to um, I can finish this let me show you first as you see now I get two parts this is the second part, uh, first part and this is the second part other that I want to divide this one also for the the uh, border one okay again edit division uh, go to sketch from the rectangle I want to for example I want to point maybe point three from uh, I want to offset from point three from this point as you see, it's for the outside but I want to to the inside so I will press uh, sp space bar click it just like this after that I want to be uh, my uh, sorry uh, point one okay the other one point one so again I can use point one or point fifteen maybe is better I'm sorry go to off uh, this one and for the offset point fifteen maybe click here and this one again press uh, space bar to get like this okay so now we have this one and now what we have we have three parts as you see this part this part this part and also this part so uh, now we divided uh, these two in into into four parts into four parts okay the cool thing here is is to 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 to, to define each one with one material so as you see I can select everything I can go to uh, as you see here I can, I can give it material but here as you see here I have a material by origin I will uncheck this one but the first of all I want to I want to bring uh, or I want to make the materials okay how can I do it I can go to uh, manage tool man manage tab and go to materials after that as you see here I can make uh, whatever materials I want uh, you see uh, we have uh, some uh, materials here okay uh, but we can do uh, ours okay from this point from here create and uh, duplicate material so I want to just click here a uh, new material I will name it uh, this one right click rename let's say center so this is the for the center one this is this part and after that create new material right click rename border again create a new material rename it and this let's say inside so this is the inside material all, all, all the materials anyhow after that I want to uh, go one by one, uh, one by one. For this, uh, for example, this is the border. Go to appearance, click on the image, and for the border, I want to use this one. Okay, apply it. After that, what I have, I have to center. Uh, but yeah, no problem. I'll do it uh, for now. And um, center, click this one. I have this image. I prepared this image. Again, I want because it's it's marble. I want to give it a, a reflect activity a little uh, so let's say we have 40 applied uh, after that the last one which we have inside again click the image I want to use this one for this uh, inside and again give it a reflectivity uh, be sure that uh, both are the same because it's the same it's just so it's it's better to give it uh, the same thing okay now we we, we we prepared the material but it's not final okay just select one by one select this one has this here material by origin I'll uncheck this one go to default material and give it this is the inside so give it the inside material 
that I prepared before this one inside and click OK you see now it's like this about the, the, the skill I will, I will make it later no problem again the same procedure uh, this is inside so I can right inside so I just bring this one as you see now it's better this two is okay again for this one and check this one go to uh, border yeah just like this you see it's pretty cool this one and check this one the center As you see, the center is just like this. Okay, no problem. I will fix this problem. We, I have this this problem here. Okay, okay, right. So how can I fix it? I can go just go to material because I have uh, this one three by three. I will go to center appearance. Click the, on the image. I will change this one uh, three by three. Okay. So we have three by three now. Just apply it. As you see, here it's just like this. I want to what what I have to do I have to offset this one uh, I think this number will uh, work with me and you can uh, you have to try and error for your your image okay and you see no it's not work for me for now uh, okay I have to uh, find the best result Maybe I click it. One point fifteen is okay for me, or one point two? I don't know. One point three. So again, um, you have to you have to uh, try and error uh, till you get uh, the. A good result so I'll stop the video now okay so as you see now is perfect the result is 1 by 1.5 1 here and 1.5 here okay so that's very good you can um, give it brightness here or you can do it as you see here you can invert it whatever you want you can do it here I don't uh, make anything now okay so this is the first one we fixed this one and the second one is inside as you see here the the marble is very small so I go to uh, inside and scale it uh, for uh, this one I can search here inside yeah again click here uh, it's 0.3 by 0.3 is uh, very small maybe I can make it 0.6 by 0.6 or again maybe point h by point h maybe this is good as you see, this is good again if uh, this one if you want to uh, make this one you can do it you can do it and it's very easy and uh, there's no difficult in uh, this uh, let me make it if so it Order appearance collect here maybe point I think now is very good okay uh, so how can I go uh, after that I want to uh, make some walls uh, around it uh, I will go to top view architectural wall any kind of wall it doesn't matter let's say we have this wall no problem uh, go to the top level and this one to the exterior just like this okay so we have this one and after that I go to architecture window 
the type of window this one maybe good uh, we have to go to level one so uh, we can go we can put a uh, window okay after that select window to type I want to make it 2.2 maybe for the width okay I can make uh, a door here I'm sorry door just like this go to level 2 make another floor to be like a ceiling for that finish it yes and after that I will go to make a camera so I'll put a camera from this side to that side just like this I will go back to level 1 and uh, go to architecture component place a component so I want to uh, just uh, place a, uh, a desk here and after that go to 3 view go to view 1 as you see here the camera uh, the eye elevation is 5 as you see I don't want to be 5 I want to be 1.6 meter the target elevation may be 0 and just apply it as you see now here I want to mention uh, something that if you want if you look at here let me change this one to fine and this one to realistic you see here uh, you cannot see the, the, the marbles okay if uh, even if we render yeah we cannot uh, see the marbles why because we have uh, something the the cool thing about that is where we have to go when we, we are selecting this one uh, this one uh, this is the 3 v one which is the camera one as you see the the part visibility the past visibility it's show original so I want to go to show parts show so it gives me that the parts that's a very cool thing behind that and maybe like this maybe like this whatever okay the height uh, elevation we have uh, we can make it one meter if we want or 1.75 anyhow after that uh, go to view render uh, just go to uh, this one maybe uh, interior sun only uh, and maybe to medium render it as you see this after that we can just uh, change some exposure uh, we can make it darker like this maybe highlights brighter or darker uh, and shadows maybe lighter uh, the saturation may be intense more intense and warmer maybe so it gives us this one brighter as you see you can just play, play around with this this, uh, this one uh, as you see here the, the the sun is in the season as you see, uh, just click it here the sun is uh, in season we, we can we can uh, uh, change this one and the setting for this one and this one uh, one uh, three five let's say uh, 80 and apply it okay let's run it again you see the direction of the sun would change it okay guys so just just we, we can we can make a, a sun with the direction of the sun we can specify them but uh, maybe I want uh, let me first uh, go to a site as you see I cannot find the, the the camera so just click this one right click and show camera so I can see this camera maybe I want to something like this or if I want from this side okay maybe just like this after that go to double click here uh, the high elevation and you want to let's say we have one meter I want to just I want to show you something uh, go to render again the same procedure 
as is here there, there's the uh, reflection uh, on the on the ground there's a reflection on the ground okay mm. I want to uh, change this one maybe to something like uh, 20 applied okay rendered again or maybe if I could increase it better I'll increase this one to something like uh, 150 maybe this one is yeah I think this one is good now is uh, this here uh, the sun is gone and no longer uh, go um, come inside the, the room but as you see here the reflectivity is very very high so I have to I have to decrease it you can't do it it's it's not not uh, something that we can we uh, discuss about as you see here the the lighter and the gray and here we have something here if it's uh, winter uh, sorry uh, summer we can just increase some some uh, color like this otherwise you can do it whatever you want just click OK after that you can just export it I want to export this picture or let's say on desktop save it close it after that go to side view again camera view I want to show it I want to just make uh, another another picture for uh, the video so that's all uh, for today guys uh, don't forget don't forget to like and subscribe this channel and if you have any question uh, write down below in the comments as you see for each one we can we can uh, change but maybe if I increase it better just like this is better for me uh, after that again so if you have any question you can you can ask me uh, no problem I will answer uh, gradually so thank you very much